Imagine a world where your privacy could be invaded instantly without your consent. How would you feel? As we progress further into the age of artificial intelligence, we're continuously astounded by the capabilities of this technology. AI has the potential to revolutionize multiple facets of our daily lives, making things more efficient and convenient. But there's a flip side to this coin. Consider Nuka, an AI camera created by two German artists, Matthias Veff and Benedikt Gross. It's a tool that can strip away clothing from images of people in real time. A technological marvel, yes, but also a potential Pandora's box. Created to spotlight the potential misuse of AI technology, Nuka raises serious questions about personal privacy. With just a smartphone, some 3D design tools, and a dash of AI magic, Nuka can predict what a person's naked body might look like. The ease and speed of this process are concerning, to say the least. As we delve into the world of AI, we must ask ourselves, is this the future we want? In the blink of an eye, your shirt disappears. No, it's not magic, it's Nuka. This AI camera, conceived by German artists Matthias Veff and Benedikt Gross, pushes the boundaries of privacy and personal space. But how does Nuka work? The process begins with the camera capturing an image, simple enough. The real magic happens in the cloud, where advanced algorithms get to work. They analyze the image using data about the subject's gender, face, age, and body shape. With this information, the AI then reconstructs a prediction of what the person's naked body would look like. What's astonishing and somewhat unsettling is the speed at which Nuka operates. It takes just about 10 seconds to process the image and create a deepfake. No advanced technical knowledge is required, making it accessible to virtually anyone with a smartphone. While the creation of deepfake images isn't a new concept, Nuka presents a notable shift in accessibility and efficiency. Previously, creating believable fake nudes required significant time investment and editing skills. Nucier, on the other hand, democratizes this power, making it as simple as snapping a photo and waiting 10 short seconds. The potential for misuse is evident. Without the need for consent to digitally undress someone, Nuka opens up new avenues for malicious activities such as cyberbullying or blackmail. It's a stark reminder of the ethical questions we must grapple with as AI technology evolves. The artist's intention was not to create a tool for harm, but rather to spark a conversation about the potential misuse of AI. They've certainly achieved that. But the question remains, how do we navigate this new reality where our privacy can be invaded so easily and quickly? Nuka is not merely a camera, it's a tool that can instantly invade your privacy. As we further explore the capabilities of AI, we need to be mindful of the potential dark sides that come with it. It's not just about what we can do, but also what we should do. Technology has not only made our lives easier, but has also opened doors to a world of deception. The rise of deep fake technologies has been a game changer. Deep fake imagery, especially those involving nude celebrities, has been lingering around adult websites for some time now. But with the advent of Nuka, the game has transformed entirely. This is a gigantic leap in terms of accessibility and efficiency. Traditionally, creating fake nudes required a sophisticated set of skills and a significant investment of time. With Nuka, however, the tables have turned. This AI camera has democratized the ability to create deep fakes, reducing the skill barrier to a mere operation that takes seconds. The time investment is minimal and the potential for misuse is unfortunately amplified. The accessibility and ease that Nuka provides is a cause for concern. It doesn't require consent to digitally undress someone. This technology can easily be misused for malicious purposes such as blackmail or cyberbullying. The artist's intention to spark a public debate on the ethical trajectory of AI development by exposing this capability is commendable. However, the technology that Nuka represents, even if not intended for commercial use, could be replicated and used unethically by others. The broader implications of such technologies are profound and far-reaching. As AI capabilities grow, so does their potential to disrupt social norms and personal security. Deep fakes are becoming increasingly realistic, blurring the lines between truth and digital fabrication. This progression threatens to complicate legal and social frameworks, making it challenging to distinguish between real and fabricated content. It's a sad reality that AI has even been used to create deep fake nudes of children for extortion. 
The potential for harm is not just a possibility, it's a reality. The power of technology like Nuka is undeniable. But as the saying goes, with power comes responsibility. And with technology like Nuka, the responsibility is enormous. It's a new reality we have to face, a reality that calls for awareness, vigilance, and accountability in the use of AI and its potential to infringe on personal privacy. Not all that glitters is gold and not all AI cameras are harmful. A statement that rings true, especially when contrasting the nefarious uses of AI cameras like Nuka with more benevolent applications. It's important to remember that technology itself is neutral. It's how we choose to use it that can tip the scale towards good or evil. Take, for example, the case of Rogers, a Canadian telecom company. They've harnessed the power of AI cameras for something truly beneficial, monitoring and preventing wildfires. By leveraging AI's capabilities, Rogers can identify potential fire hazards before they become full-blown disasters. This is an example of AI in action, contributing positively to the environment and potentially saving lives. On the other side of the Atlantic, French police are exploring the use of AI cameras to bolster security for the upcoming Paris Olympics in 2024. These cameras, equipped with advanced algorithms, can spot any dangerous activities or suspicious behavior in real time ensuring the safety of athletes, spectators, and staff alike during the prestigious global event. This application of AI technology is a testament to how it can be used to enhance public safety, making large-scale events safer for everyone involved. These examples serve as a stark contrast to the potential misuse of AI cameras like Nuka. They highlight how AI, when wielded ethically, can greatly benefit society, from environmental protection to public safety, but they also underscore the importance of setting boundaries and ethical guidelines in the use of such technology. Yes, AI cameras can be a double-edged sword. They can be used to invade privacy, as with NUCA, or they can be harnessed for the greater good, as with Rogers and the French police. The key lies in responsible use and strict regulation to prevent misuse. Indeed, the development and adoption of AI technologies bring with them a host of ethical dilemmas. But as we've seen, they also hold immense potential for positive change. As we move forward in this digital age, it's crucial that we strike a balance, ensuring these technologies are used for the benefit of all and not to the detriment of some. AI cameras, when wielded with care, can be powerful tools for good. The potential of AI is immense, but so is its capacity to disrupt and harm. As we delve into the ethical trajectory of AI development, we're faced with profound implications. AI technologies like Nuka possess an ability to disrupt social norms and personal security, presenting a significant ethical dilemma. Imagine a world where anyone with a smartphone can create realistic, deepfake images in mere seconds. This isn't a distant, dystopian future, it's a reality we're rapidly approaching. The ease and speed at which technologies like Nuka operate not only democratize the creation of deepfakes, but also amplify the potential for misuse. This raises a number of ethical concerns. Without requiring consent to digitally undress someone, such technologies easily lend themselves to malicious uses, blackmail, cyberbullying, and even more sinister applications become worryingly accessible. The broader implications of this technological advancement are stark. As AI capabilities grow, so does their potential to disrupt the fabric of our society. Deepfakes are becoming increasingly realistic, blurring the lines between truth and digital fabrication. This progression poses a threat to our legal and social frameworks. As we grapple with distinguishing real from fabricated content, we're faced with a new wave of challenges. AI technologies could complicate legal proceedings, muddle the truth in journalism, and even manipulate public opinion, creating a ripple effect on our society. We're standing at a crossroads. The potential of AI is boundless, offering countless opportunities for progress and innovation. Yet, we must be cautious. The dark side of AI, represented by technologies like Nuka, prompts us to question the trajectory we're on. As we navigate the complexities of AI development, we must balance the immense potential of these technologies with the ethical considerations they bring to light. It's crucial that we foster an environment of responsibility and accountability in AI development. 
As AI blurs the lines between reality and digital fabrication, we must question, is this the path we want to tread? It's a question we all need to ponder, as the answer will shape the future of our digital world. We stand at the crossroads of technological advancement and ethical responsibility. It's a moment in time that demands not just our attention, but our active participation. As we marvel at the leaps we've made in artificial intelligence, we must not lose sight of the potential pitfalls that come with these advancements. The case of Nuke, this seemingly harmless AI camera, is a stark reminder of the potential misuse of AI technology. It's not just about what we can create, but how these creations can be used or abused. We need to foster a culture of critical thinking and robust public debate around these ethical implications. Each one of us has a role to play, whether it's simply staying informed, advocating for ethical AI development, or challenging technologies that may infringe on personal privacy. The future of AI is in our hands. We have the power to shape it, to ensure it serves us, not harms us. Let's use that power wisely.